Yo, what up? Hit that like button, subscribe. If you're returning, welcome back to all my day ones, my returning subscribers. And welcome back if you're new here, you know. So uh, we're going to get right into it, man. As you can see, you know, decided to do an audio type of video today. So that's the style of the video today. Uh, I'm back, you know, just went through some situations. And in these situations, you know, I learned a couple things, man. Watch how you make moves out here, you know, in life. See, uh, I've dealt with a, you know, <laughs> ample amount, uh, a plethora of individuals, you know, many people who have uh, made very poor choices. And see, some of these choices that they made, they didn't think it would really, you know, affect them. Effect, effect, both effects, you know. See, they didn't believe that their choices that they made to people negative, you know, maybe they treated someone bad, or maybe they broke someone's heart, or maybe they thought they would get away with a murder or whatever. But in any case, these individuals seem to reap what they have sown. It may not be now. It may not be in a couple weeks, a couple minutes, a couple years. But eventually that one day, it will come, you know, whether you've made uh, positive choices here or not. Move the right way in life. Uh, treat others with respect. You know, the old saying is treat others the way you want to be treated. Well, just treat everyone the same with respect. And you're not always going to get it back. See, there's some people out here that, you know, don't care about how they treat others or what they do. See, the only time these individuals tend to care is when it's either too late or they've just burned so many bridges they have uh, not enough material to cross over the water now. They've, you know, ran out of material to build the bridge. They burned it. They destroyed it. And these bridges, see, they happen to be connections, maybe family, friends, maybe acquaintances that helped you along the way. But see, how you treat these people will come back to affect you. So if you treat them good and you've helped them, maybe they'll help you. You know, anything can happen. You must learn to walk in this life good. You must learn to help others, learn to give, learn to see others and their potential, you know, even if they can't see it, learn to uplift them, motivate them, tell them they can make it. Sometimes even myself, as I motivate you to continue your life and your achievements and your goals to succeed, I have to have someone to motivate me too, man. You know, you got to uplift your brother, you know, or sister or whatever. And you have to let them know just as much as you're achieving and attaining, they can do the same thing. But see, don't allow others to be the type to they have to copy you to get there. Tell them they don't have to copy you to get there. Tell them that you have to find what it is that they enjoy to do. Tell them that. They have to find what they love and what they like. Because, see, everybody likes different things. Some things we may relate on and, you know, we understand each other at that level. But other things, everybody has different routines and patterns, see. So, you know, I hope you guys learned something from this. I hope what you've learned from this is that... You know, you have to move accordingly. I've met people out there who have caused nothing but torment, havoc, destruction, heartbreak, all kinds of things to people. And now their lives today are 
miserable beyond explanation. See, their lives now are of torment and nightmares and stress and financial worries and things as such. For I remember a long time ago, there was someone who used to bully me, multiple bullies. And now I see these bullies, the same people who would, you know, uh, tell me education and things as such are foolish and these things. And these are the same people that are addicted to street drugs. These are the same people that have not attained or achieved anything because they thought it was more cool to blow their money on clothes or blow their money on nothing towards the future. See, always make decisions that are towards the future. You know, always understand that every move you make, it will have a consequence. Excuse me, it will have a consequence, either a short consequence or a long term consequence. See, a short term consequence would be I kick something and I scrape my leg, it'll heal in a few. And a long term consequence is having kids that you can't financially be able to take care of. See, these are two different examples. Guys, I have not had my phone for uh it was about 14 days that's why i was gone for so long i just want to take this time to say thank you guys we're literally so close to this one thou man it's crazy i hope you guys enjoyed this little you know video just telling you guys you know uh that You know, every choice you make will have a determination upon your future, you know, so make the right choices. I've seen so many people make the wrong choices, man, time after time, and you would think they would learn from those first, you know, mistakes. Uh, What's the old saying? It's called, uh, fool me once, shame on me, fool me twice, or fool me once, shame on you, fool me twice, shame on me, you know. So don't make the same mistakes twice. Learn to learn from your mistakes and don't make them again. You know, I'm learning from my mistake of why I was in this situation to not be able to have this phone. And I'm learning don't go back to the past and make those same decisions again. You have to learn to grow from them and get away. You know, that's how you become, you know, wise. That's how you learn that's how you're able to teach others the only way you're able to teach others is to make a mistake and when you make a mistake see that mistake people will know when they see how terrible your life is or whatever choices or misery that you created that that's not the right way for them to go and that gives them a better direction but see unfortunately someone's gonna have to be the punching bag you know i had to be the punching bag to be able to tell you these life lessons you know Uh, take care of things before they get bad you know i decided to uh not care to fix my phone when i knew i should have fixed the phone screen and then uh one day i was playing a video game and my phone said and the phone went black man yeah i was like i can't make no videos i can't do nothing so that's the update guys with a little advice in there mix it up for you But I hope you guys enjoyed this audio version, man. I just wanted to try something different. And uh, until I get my new equipment, I I need to get new headphones and an adapter for the headphone because I have an iPhone. And uh, once I do that, I'll be back to the mic. We'll be back to the regular videos. Don't worry. I got you guys. I got you. And uh, yeah. And let me know down in the comments, man, what you guys think of... uh, you know, people who don't think about their decisions and then afterwards they have long-term bad consequences from the choices that they didn't think about in that moment, you know. Don't don't live your life like YOLO, you only live one moment. Ooh, yeah, you only live once. Yeah, so if you only live once, live it right, man. So you don't mess it up. But what do I know, right? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, man, stay motivated to do the things that you said you were going to do stay determined and uh stay out those fucking jail cells because the same things that you would do illegally you can do legally so don't commit no crime man and uh if you guys are wondering 
you know, I haven't been working on the audio book for a little bit. I just, you know, like I told you guys, I develop chapters as I go through life and live. And every time I learn a new lesson, I'll, you know, make a chapter about it. But uh, eventually I'll get to a new chapter. Make sure you guys check out the Redbubble store. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, man. Show your boy some love, man. Thank you. Appreciate you guys. Stay motivated. I hope you guys are doing good in life and achieving what you came to this channel to achieve, man. Don't worry, man. Advice from Jay ain't going nowhere, man. They tried to attack me, man. They tried to take away my phone. Tried to make me mentally stressed. You know, I was going through it, man. I'm not going to lie. I told you guys if one day goes off, you know, I get stressed. But, uh had to fight through it man every day i gotta fight this is me fighting to the extreme making this video making this audio for you man i'm sitting on the side of my bed looking out the window thinking one day man i'll hit that one thou one day i'll achieve my goals one day this video will change somebody and it'll change their life and they'll be able to say thank you jay you, you helped change my life i succeeded i went to college i got my license i did this i did that good man keep achieving man that's all i want that's why i made the videos to uplift you guys entertain you with some bad videos here and there you know just for fun make some fails and stuff like that you know but i'm pushing man and you better get ready for them new shorts, man. We ain't going to be drawing them same cartoons no more. Man, do y'all hear that, man? Do y'all hear that, man? Fucking knowledge, man. Vice from Jay, and I'm back, man. Stay motivated. Don't let anybody stop you from achieving your goals and make the right decisions so you ain't having a long-term, miserable life thinking about all the wrong decisions or what you could have done when you could do it right now. I'm out, man. Fuck. Get knowledge, man. Hit that like button and subscribe, man.